DOC has a lot of technology debt. Uh, most of the computers at the Department of Corrections are anywhere from 8 to 20 years old. Whenever we started, you know, working through the implementation of Zscaler, that really helped um, the Department of Corrections as they started, um, you know, moving to a platform that wasn't so intensive on older architectures, um, things that made um, working from home more stable. That was one of the challenges that we had. The other thing was we had two different uh, VPN solutions. Um, and so with Zscaler, we were actually able to standardize on one. Uh, and, and it actually helped a lot of people uh, understand how to get to their files, get to their, their information. Prior to the Zscaler rollout, we did not have a, a proxy because we didn't have a good way to deploy that. So for the first time, we're actually able to uh, you know, help help protect people from you know the sites that they're not supposed to be able to get to but at the same time um, you know protect the state from from having any malicious attempts to uh, you know through web browsing the most uh, obvious benefit from using Zscaler is, is sustainability and, and stability I mean we, we had with multiple solutions we didn't have the ability for people to access their files stably that was the first efficiency um, the, the second thing is once people got connected, they really were uh, connected at about five times the speed that they were before. And we were able to test that. It was five times faster than what our previous VPN solution was. DOC, they had to maintain a physical presence. And so Zscaler allowed us to uh, be dynamic with our connections in a way that, you know, some people were at home at some days and some people were... Uh, some people were working from the office and so without having to worry about where they were it always worked the same way and it was always stable and very reliable. This was kind of a, a, an interesting challenge uh, for us before Zscaler because we would have to buy very large uh, and, and connected network uh, connections from our internet service providers and so uh, by implementing Zscaler we're actually able to scale down in, in the cost uh, quite significantly because we're able to reduce sometimes up to you know five to six times the the cost by going with the cheaper mom-and-pop internet connection. I've never seen a as close of a, a vendor connection with with anyone else that we've done implementations through you know it was a hand-in-hand implementation with the engineers you know and, and I've, I've actually never seen uh, you know whenever a, a user c mentions that there's something uh, that they need addressed throughout the implementation that that there's a team of engineers on it immediately.